If I land this, we have to buy a Humvee and then lift it. Here we go. Let's see. Did we land it? Totally landed that. Ta-da. See, we landed it. What'd I tell you? Well, I guess I'm going to have to go find a Humvee for sale real quick. By the way, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you like and subscribe. If we hit 150,000 subs by November 22nd, I'll give away 10 copies of Farm Sim 22. Also this Saturday at 2 p.m., I'll be participating in the Farming Simulator versus Childhood Cancer fundraising tournament. So make sure you tune in for that. And don't forget, a lot of your other favorite Farming Sim uh, content creators will be participating in that as well. I gotta say, this uh, Velociraptor that we built last time, she's got some good top-end speed, just not very fast 0 to 60. Well, I called up a guy on Facebook Marketplace, and he said that he could bring the humvee that he had for sale out here and he did so let's take a look at it right there it is this is a old humvee i have no idea what year or anything like that but he said it's for sale for a pretty good price so we're gonna hop inside fire it up and uh we'll see how it runs here oh we sit a little low in the humvee don't we I gotta say this thing's pretty cool, but I think we're gonna do a whole lot of work to it if we do end up buying this, and I think we're gonna put a lift kit on it as well. Because who doesn't want a lifted Humvee? Nothing screams America like a lifted Humvee and hitting a car going down the highway and doing a barrel roll yet landing on your on your feet. <laughs> yeah, I mean, hey, this thing is, uh, you know, it's nothing amazing, but I'm pretty sure we can make it pretty amazing. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm sold. I think we're gonna go ahead and buy the Humvee, so let's get it up to the house, and uh, we're gonna get to work right away here this morning. Ooh, you know, while we're while we're headed back home, I think this is a perfect opportunity for us to see how wow, okay, the Humvee handles rock climbing like a champ into a tree. Now I see why the military loves to use these. It's a it's a beast. It literally climbed up that with no problem at all. Kinda makes a fellow wonder how it's gonna handle it when it's uh lifted up. Well, we've made it back. Now I think naturally we're going to have to see how it handles the mud path here. So let's whip it around and here we go. Let's see how the Humvee handles mud. Yeah, pretty beastly. I mean overall, ooh, ooh, we got a little deep right there it slows down a little bit that's for sure Ex especially in certain areas but overall i mean it seems to handle it look at this see a tank it just doesn't even care we can do it in reverse a tornado could pick us up right now and throw us five miles to the south and we would be just fine but seriously the humvee is an absolute beast it it really doesn't care what you put it through it just goes although now we got mud splattered all up in the inside of our deal so that's always a fun time all right, here we go. The best part of the whole course, if we can hit it at a high enough speed, that is. Here we go. Come on. Nope. Nope. Okay, guess we cannot. All right. Well, either way, the Humvee seems to handle it. So, uh, you know, I'm going to give it a pass. It wasn't amazing, but it, it it got through it. So let's just Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Dang. Okay. I was going to try and grind on that through after I hit it through the air, but I guess not. Never mind. It's not quite good enough to Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3 it, but that's fine. Tell you what we're going to do. We're going to pull up here, give it a quick wash off because we drove it through the mud, and we'll get it into the shop start tearing her apart and we'll see what we can get into Whew, you guys are not gonna believe the amount of work we just put into this thing right here as you can see we lifted up the humvee we also gave it a whole new paint scheme we put on some new bumpers and everything put on some light bars put on a new front bumper and the interior is really where the changes shine we put a whole civilian style interior in here to kind of make it a little bit more luxury and luxury it is i mean look we have cup holders and air conditioning the two most luxury things a guy could ask for but i suppose it's fire up and let's see how this big old beast handles the mud now shall we oh we also put an axle dump uh, exhaust on it as well as you can see right there and yes it absolutely loves burning dinosaur bones oh no we flipped it good lord well something about that uh, high center of gravity is definitely throwing it off a little bit now but it seems to crawl through mud all right i mean it, it's really not much better than it was before but it seems to be doing the job so overall can't complain it's a little top heavy though that's definitely a problem Woo! Oh, no, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, nice. Is this thing a Cadillac? Because, boy, does it land on its feet. We put in a bigger engine. We can make this baby purr as well. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh. Wait for it. We'll land on our feet. Everything's fine. All right, maybe I lied. Maybe we're not going to land on our feet this time. But it's okay, because I ate some magic muffins, and they gave me the power of reset vehicle. So <laughs> everybody's favorite power. All right, well, we know how this thing handles the mud park. We know how it handles some of the hills out here. But I want to see how it handles being flung off the side of a mountain. Not well. Not well at all. And we are definitely stuck in between a tree and a hard place here. Up, 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 up. Well, we kind of got it out from the tree, but now we've entered. We're like a turtle on our back. 
back, bro. If there's anything that I do great, it's tipping vehicles onto the roof. Yep, see, I told you, it's my specialty. Yeah, this thing's all fun, and but uh, but I kind of wonder, you know, do you think I can not tip for like five seconds, maybe? Do you think I can make it wheelie? That's always the good, uh, you know, test of how good is a Humvee, or really anything for that matter. Airplane, wheelie. Bagel from the deli, wheelie. Chris Pratt in a Marvel movie, wheelie. See, people think actor's highest, you know, <laughs> accreditation is uh, getting an Oscar, but it's not. It's actually doing a wheelie. I think you and I both know how we're going to do this. The only problem is pretty sure that this does not have straps. So we'll see what happens. Right off the bat, I can tell you it does not want to wheelie. That's okay. I've never given up so easy in my life. Well, I give up. I take it all back. I give up easy now. This ATV is kind of acting like Spider-Man. Oh, no, never mind. All right, new, uh, new form of validation. Can it run? over the ATV. Yes. Yes, it can. Actually, you know what I want to do? I want to build a ramp. And not like one of the puny little mud ramps we have up here, like an actual proper ramp that kind of ramps off the side of a mountain. What do you say? In fact, I think I know the perfect place to build it, right over here. All we gotta do is whip out the old trusty chainsaw and cut down some trees real quick. Woo, there we go. Nice little open area there. All right, now we just run up to the house and I have some extra lumber sitting around. Ooh, there we go. When I build a ramp, I mean a ramp. All right, Humvee, it's your time to shine, baby. Oh, and for those of you wonder, you know, worried about my safety, don't worry. I have the best health care money can buy. It's called Red Bull and a couple Slim Jims. Here we go. If we can get speed out of the mud, you know, that, that would be greatly important. This is definitely not going to work now that we have very little... Sp oh, boy, this is going to go poorly. Woo! We definitely made it far. Look at that. He didn't say that sarcastic at all. Yup, definitely made it real far. Y'all, that was absolutely pathetic. I'm kind of disappointed. I mean, we did land it though. But aside from landing it, that sucked. All right, we'll give it one more time with the hum. But if it sucks, then we're going to try the ramp with something else. See, the problem is, is we've got our mud park in the way of the ramp. So I need to find a way to get to the ramp without going through the mud park. One could do that if one was to build a bridge. Oh, I don't know. Fudge! No! We rolled it! I lost all my speed and momentum! And that temper tantrum is brought to you by Nitrato. Pre-order your FS22 game servers now. <clears throat> Away from the shameless plug, let's now see if we can hit this- Whoa, 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 the trees are back! Oh, never mind. I just- my eyesight is lying to me. I've had one too many Red Bulls today. Here we go. Come on. Ramp it good this time. Dude, it's like E.T. when he, If the moon was out right now, that would be so perfect and dude oh 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 we didn't we did not land it that's fine i know what to do when i don't land things slice and dice all right well you know what here's the deal the uh the hummer you know it doesn't really ma manage the ramp very well so let's try something else out on the ramp shall we and hey why not try the uh the atv i mean it was right here remember kids always ride with a helmet never not ride with a helmet because otherwise this may happen to you we oh 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 hey i'll call that success all right so turns out we just suck at going anywhere at all we just i don't know if i just don't have enough speed for this ramp what's my fastest vehicle oh we could do the velociraptor works pretty well but it needs a lot of speed ah man you know what let's try it all right here we go we're gonna try and get a bunch of speed and we're gonna see how fast we can hit this going down the hill come on come on come on keep getting speed keep getting speed keep going keep going keep going more and more and more and more and more i need more i need more yes all right we launched it at 85 that's definitely not the best we could do but It'll work. Hey, we made a pretty good distance this time onto a tree. Oh gosh. Oh, oh, hey bear. Did you uh, do you know, did you like what you see? Did you like it, bear? Yeah. Who's a good bear? You're a good bear. Hey, I'm gonna name you Bear Grills. <laughs> Don't drink your own pee now. I know, disgusting, but that's something that Bear Grills would actually do. All right, so here's the deal. The Ford, it was okay. But now that we've taken the Ford Velociraptor off the ramp, I'm, I'm kind of curious about something else. So uh, y you'll find out. Wow, the fact that you can see our ramp from all the way over here is kind of impressive. All right, guys, here we go. I think you already know what's about to happen. All right, here we go now. Oh, oh gosh, no, not into the tree. Oh, no, 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 no. Stupid jet has got to ruin everything. Don't worry, we got it pulled out. We're firing up the engines, and we're going to try it again here in three, two, one. Let's roll. Come on, baby. Right on up that ramp. Come on now. Woo! There we go. That's the takeoff. Yeah! Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Get speed. Get speed. Get speed. Get speed. Keep left. 
Yeah! Positive rotation and we are out of here, dude. That's exactly how we should take off airplanes in the real world. Why don't we launch them up ramps? Why is this not a thing that's happening? That worked perfectly. All right, let's bring that nose down nice and easy. There we go. We... Hey, this is exactly how you land an airplane, right? Just kind of hover it down on in like it's a, uh, like it's a helicopter and you land across the uh, runway like boop. Right there, I like that. See, that's exactly how you do it. Well, I'm not gonna lie. The, uh, the airplane actually handled the ramp a lot better than I thought it would. So let's, uh, let's get back up to the ranch, shall we? All right, so we've tried the Velociraptor, we've tried the Humvee, the ATV, and the airplane. Now we gotta try one more thing. So we could ramp our giant one-wheeled tractor. Or, you know what I mean, the nose, the narrow nose trike. Our regular Chevy. Our lifted Ford that likes to do wheelies. Whatever that thing is. Our Toyota trash truck. Or this abomination. I think we'll take the Toyota. Woo! All right, come on, Toyota. Show me you what you got. No tippy, no tippy. Dang it! Why are you so tippy, you sorry little... And we've entered a state of tranquility. Let's try that again. I don't think we're going to be able to get as much speed this time, but we'll make it work. So here we go. Right up the ramp, up the ramp, up the ramp, up the ramp, up the... Wow, dude, you suck. You're pathetic. You're nothing. You're trash. You want to be a truck, but you're not. This is where you belong, in the woods. Just, just, you know what? Even better yet. Much better. You deserve to be caught on fire. All right, well, you know what? I think that's going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give a big old thumbs up and subscribe. If you want to see us ramp, ramp more things off of our giant ramp on the side of a mountain, then uh, let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace. Can you picture you and me in the darkness? Kissing, touching.